get started, and I think somebody, one of our Q girls, has a story of the week. So, Amanda? It's not story of the week, per se, but last time we got together, I was telling you guys how I was on an endless job hunt, and I sent out hundreds of resumes, and it was impossible to find a job. But I just want to tell everyone it's not hopeless, and there are jobs out there. I actually went in for an interview for a sales and marketing position at a really big telecommunications company right downtown. And I was really hoping to get it and I went in, they offered me the job and then I met with the president of the company today and he's like, you know, I know we offered you this position but I'm really sorry, I'm not gonna be able to give it to you. And I was like, what do you mean? He's like, I just think you're way too overqualified, I'm gonna have to give you a management position. Oh, right. <laughs> That's I thought you were going to punch him. Right. <laughs> I almost did. I almost started crying. But that's my exciting news of the week. Well, that's fabulous news. Congratulations. Yeah, especially in this economy that's been, you know, it's, we've, we're just coming out of a recession right now, um, but nobody really knows how long this is going to last. Actually, it's been, you know, uh, unemployment is going up, pushing 10%. Um, these kind of factors are coming into play. Um, you know, then with all the mortgage crisis, world financial crisis, stuff like that, it's really tough to find a job. I know everybody that's been without a job or has been laid off. The real problem has been that people that are more qualified than them are filling up the lower spots nowadays, you know. And yesterday was on television that college kids and teenagers can't find jobs because adults are taking them. So it's really pretty ridiculous, but unfortunately that's where we are. Yeah, and it's really discouraging because you can be overly qualified for the position, but if there's 20 other people up for the same position, you're not going to get it, you know. It's just, it's really, really sparse out there. They're going to hire whoever works for the least amount of money. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And if you're overqualified, then you, you need, they're going to have to pay you more money. You're That's what's happening with teachers. And then they're always worried, are you going to stay in that job? Mm -hmm. You know, right. because if you're qualified, overqualified for a job, they'll be like, well, you're going to leave as soon as you find something, you know. That's right. what's happening with teachers. Like, older teachers that have a lot of experience are out of work right now because younger, like, new teachers are willing to work for a lot less pay. Certainly.